My name is Bill and welcome to my intro crypto. Today we have Chainlink Link Daily Update. We are going to see the exact targets. Before we continue, do not forget to join our monthly subscription. Patreon slash Mindro Crypto 7 days free trial on professional, on everyday trading scalping strategy. Thank you for watching. Have a fantastic day. Let's start. So right here, you can see that Chainlink had the crash that we were talking about for so long, right? You can see that eventually it couldn't hold the support level. We found double retest on the 6 USDT in the daily frame. And this was one of the reasons that Chainlink had a minus 17% to 18% crash. Starting from this top to this bottom, it was actually more than 20%, right? Look at that. Almost reaching the first support level that we were talking about, a reaccumulation phase. Now, I'm not, I will be completely honest with you. I'm not so optimistic about Chainlink. And to be honest with you, I really think that Chainlink will have a hard time making higher lows right now. After this crash and after this weekly close, probably closing below the 5.93. If anything happens, I mean that, I think that we will close below, right? But of course, we have two days until we see the weekly close. Maybe something will change. But apart from that, you can see 4.616 is the support level that I think Chainlink will revisit, maybe buying pressure from there. And as you all know, I think that Chainlink will be going down from 3.68, even further down, right? So you will see that. Have this video saved, I told you multiple times. Have the videos that we were talking about Chainlink saved because it is going to happen. It is going to happen that we cross more than 20%. I told you that in these days, right? Where we were all in these days, I've told you that. We have a bearish pennant here, a weekly bearish pennant. We are going to hugely cross. Now, this wasn't the case only with Chainlink. Many, many altcoins crossed as well. Ethereum more than minus 6%. The graph more than minus 10 Bitcoin more than minus 3%. But Bitcoin was actually uh, one of the coins, the king, as we call it, that didn't go as much down as the altcoins, right? You can see only minus 2.42. This shouldn't bring such despair in the market. But yeah, Link crashed down. It was its time to crash. Um, Nevertheless, no matter what Bitcoin would be going to do, it would be pumping a little bit, dumping a little bit. It was its time to fall down. And now into the weekly frame, expect more correction. In the lower time frames, there is a good possibility that we see something like a pump towards maybe the 5.31, right? And then dump. Okay, maybe we are going to go to the 5.31 right here, maybe a little bit further higher. But however, the case right now with Chainlink, is that we are going to see a momentum of lower lows and lower highs in the weekly scale. That means that we are going to go down to the 4.61, maybe even further down into the next few weeks. You can see how quickly things can turn bad into the crypto market. Do not forget to join our monthly subscription, Patreon slash Crypto. Thank you for watching. Have a fantastic day and see you soon. Bye.